Oh, 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 okay. At Weather's least fantastic. three dumps before the race, minimum. <laughs>
you have eight kilometers of running in between each kilometer of running you have a strength station eight different strength stations uh, so it's combining both cardio endurance with muscular and strength endurance all into one i'm super excited and uh, today we're going to be doing a workout that is going to be training for this event the event is end of november so we've got three or four months to train and uh, let me walk you through the workout today all right so today's workout is very simple it's four rounds we start off with 500 meter run on the assault runner and then we go into 50 wall balls for the 15 pound wall ball then we do a 500 meter ski on the skier we finish the round off with a 40 meter burpee broad jump oh shit <laughs> sorry four rounds of that the goal is to just not stop moving no rest in between just keep it nice and steady that's how race day is going to be so we want to simulate that as much as we can so it's going to gonna suck it's gonna be hard but um it'll be a fun workout very dynamic lots of different functionalities going on so let's get into it on race day during high rocks we'll be running on a track but for convenience purposes when we're in the gym like this it's easier to just hop on the treadmill i'm not too worried about the running portions because that's that's kind of my main thing is the running but combining the strength with the running is where the challenge will really come it's just the strength requires so much more energy and you gotta be focused on your form. And it's just a whole other engine that you gotta train and build. So it's something new to train for, something exciting. And uh, I'm really excited to just dive headfirst into a new sport and, uh, and try and figure it out. I'd like to take a quick break from this video to tell you guys about these shorts. These are the 10,005 inch interval shorts. These are one of my favorite running, lifting, everyday shorts that I own. They are super, super comfortable. There's this nice liner on the inside of the shorts here. There's a slot for your phone right here. There's two big front pockets on the side here. There's a zipper pocket to hold anything valuable. I absolutely love these shorts. These are perfect for running, perfect for lifting. Pretty much the ideal shorts for high rocks, which is, as you know, what I'm training for right now. They come in all kinds of colors. You can get them in five inch, seven inch, nine inch, depending on how you prefer the length of the shorts. I am a huge fan of the 10,000 interval shorts. I highly recommend checking some out for yourself. You can use my code Jeremy15 to save yourself 15% at 10,000.cc. Any 10,000 products, including the five inch interval shorts that I'm wearing right now. Guys are so hard. I think I gotta figure out my my pacing. <laughs> I'm smoked already. Everybody telling me that it's gonna be a man. Y'all don't know my struggles, then y'all don't know shit. Y'all be waiting till you get a flat tie to get fixed. Y'all been waiting on Michael Jackson to tell you this is it. I improve the improv, I don't read scripts. When you got punches, nigga, you don't need kicks. And I don't blend well, but I'm always in the mix. So the sky, I, I, watch baby planes fly. I, I. All right, we just finished 36.20, final time. That was brutal. Definitely not way too hot. Uh, I think the first round took me like six minutes. I was flying. Then I think each each round after that I got <laughs> progressively slower. But uh, I, I keep learning every time I do one of these big workouts. I learn so much. Probably the biggest thing is like pacing, pacing myself. Everybody feels good the first round of a workout, but you can't take the bait and go out too fast. Uh, if you are training for high rocks, or even if you're not, and you want to try this workout 
do it. Tag me in it. Tell me your time. Uh, hopefully you beat me. 36.20 is the time to beat, but holy crap. These workouts are brutal. Uh, they're fun, but they're hard. So great workout here at Onnit today. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna go uh, take a rest now because I'm dying. Ooh, that's a lot of sweat. It's hot in this gym. It's humid here in Austin. And I'm just a sweaty guy, that's what you get. To continue this busy day, we are now heading to Cooldown, downtown Austin. This is the group run that I lead every single Wednesday. It's so much fun. It's super, super social. Uh, we get together probably anywhere from 100 to 250 people every single week to go run either three or five miles. It's, um, it's very laid back, it's very chill, and it's a lot of fun. So uh, we're heading down to downtown Austin now. Today's been crazy. Had our switchback shoot this morning, had our high rocks workout, uh, tried to squeeze in a little bit of work in the afternoon, and then uh, now we're heading downtown for our, our group run. So lots of driving around, lots of uh, content today, but it's been fun. So we'll see you down at Cooldown.